Hello there. Um, I'd like to show you one of our newest rings. This is our newest spike ring. Um, it's a really beautiful ring as usual. It's very heavy, um, robust, very quality ring, solid sterling silver. Uh, this ring weighs in at uh, 34.6 grams, I believe it is. Here, I'll show you on our scale. And the nice thing about this ring, 34.6 grams. This thing is really built like a battle tank. If you look at the shank, you can see it's got a nice thick shank on it, as all of our rings. That's one of our trademarks here at Tarantula Designs. Um, <clears throat> it's just got a really cool look to it. It's a newly designed spike ring. The ring tapers from the shank out to the head, as you can see. And then you have three spikes. The two on the end are shorter than the one in the center. It has a brushed finish. Uh, because this is the kind of ring that you're going to wear around, obviously. Uh, it's, it's more of a biker style, for sure. And uh, this is not the kind of ring that you want to wear with a suit and a tie, so we're going to put a polished finish on. It just wouldn't look right, but uh, we can do that. So this ring is really heavy. It's a size 13 and a half. Um, it's very, very robust. You know, it's custom cast in clay from start to finish. No lost wax hair. These rings are handmade individually, one by one. And um, this ring is just a real badass. So hold on a sec here, and I'm going to put this on my finger so you can see what it looks like. There we have it. <clears throat> this is just a real kick ass ring for a kick ass guy. Now, if you got a big finger uh, like I do, this ring is just the right tick. And um, as I said, you know, you're going to feel like you, you have something on your hand here. Unlike uh, a lot of rings nowadays are made so thin and, you know, so cheap that um, you just feel like you got ripped off. You may have bought a beautiful design, you know, but after you, after you put it on your hand, you realize uh, it, it's not so cool after all. And I'll give you an example. Here's a ring that's uh, a really awesome design. And um, <clears throat> if you look closely, you'll see the shank is very blade thin, very thin. It's super easy to break this shank. And what it does is it makes the ring very light. Whereas with our rings, we keep those sticks, those, uh, I'm sorry, those shanks nice and thick. So that uh, the probability of you bending this ring is very low. So we want these rings to be very strong, robust. We want them to attract your attention immediately the minute you hold it in your hand. And um, our idea is that, you know, the market is saturated with rings like this that are made very thin. This one's not too bad. As you can see that the face is, has got a solid back to the face. But it's a very thin face because there's a platter underneath. So that was the whole, the whole idea to uh, not hollowing it out. They didn't want to make it too obvious. But... All the rings today are very thin in the shank, and they're very light and tinny, you know. It's like they're made more for a girl than they are for a guy. Not our rings. Our rings we want to slap you in the face with a good, healthy dose of holy crap. We want people to look at our stuff and say, you know, you don't see this kind of stuff around anywhere. And I know you don't, because I've, I am a jewelry lover. First, before I'm a jewelry manufacturer. And I have searched high and low over the years for stuff like this and could never find it and that's because they just don't want to give you this kind of quality they like to cheap out on the designs they like to hollow out the backs they like to make the shanks very thin like this because they want to give you the least amount of sterling silver or precious metal for your money they want to capture your eye with the design and then they want to take your money and leave you stranded with very little sterling silver. Well, here at Tarantula Designs, our goal is to give you a nice, hefty, decent piece of sterling silver. Or precious metal, uh, depending on what, what the ring is made of. And we want you to be very happy with it when you put it on your finger. We want you to feel like, you know, I'm a man and I'm wearing a man's ring. I'm not wearing a ring that's weighted for a, more for a girl than it is for a guy. So there you have it. This is our newest spike ring. This thing is just kick-ass, ladies and gentlemen. I'm telling you, if you're riding a Harley, people are going to love this ring. It's 34.6 grams, very heavy, and badass. So thanks once again. And remember, these rings are all made by hand from start to finish in clay, not lost wax. So 
whatever rings we do make in this style we're making them by hand and generally we usually only make 10 of each piece because it's just <clears throat> very tedious to, to do by hand it takes a lot of time and effort and um, it's not something that you know like with lost wax you can mass produce these things 10 at a pop 20 at a pop but we're not we're not doing that we want to pay attention to the detail and we, and we want our trademark qualities in our ring and our trademark qualities are the weight the quality of the piece the thickness the way it slaps you in the face and says I'm made for a man not for a girl okay so thank you very much for looking and that's 34.6 grams our newest spike ring thanks again